Hi, my name's Sam. I'm with Deer Run Farms here in New York. i um, going to give you a little bit of a implement tour of the machines I've created out of the Tillmore products. Uh, the first one we got here is what we call the cultivator sweeps. We would use this um, when you're cultivating the first cultivation of a crop. When you're, I use this to mix in fertilizer after I've uh, side dressed it alongside. It's also good to just clean up a couple weeds when the, the crops are almost ready to harvest because you can get in and um, get in between the rows without damaging anything. Uh, the reason that we like to use this is because we have two uh, sweeps on either side of the row that get um, in between where you know the lettuce is in the, on the row and we can get on, on both sides, knock the weeds down, and then the, the sweeps come and they hill it back up. So we keep the, we keep the, the bed shape uh, the way we like it. And then um, the one that's on this tractor we call the sweep, the, the knives, the vegetable knives. This is the very first um, implement that goes in the field after the seeds come up. You go right alongside, you, take the, you knock the weeds away from the plant, and it's a very specific tool. It only does one function, just knocks those, like the two inches on either side of the row, it takes those weeds out. That's the most important because when they start growing next to the plant, you can never get rid of them. So get them early, get them small, and then you're way set up for success down the road. Uh, then over here we got the basket weeder. I have it set up for four rows. We grow all of our herbs on four rows. I have it set up pretty wide so I just get it when they're small. And then as the vegetables grow, they kind of make a canopy and they shade out the, the ground that's exposed and the weeds uh, don't really grow back after that. So this is really a useful tool that we've never had on the farm before. Uh, we, we figured out that uh, it's good for mixing fertilizer as well. Uh, we didn't really have a way to do that before this machine. It's been a very welcome addition to the cultivation fleet here. And then we move down, I got my two row finger weeder push out sort of thing. It's kind of a hybrid where we go after the plants established, after transplanting, we go and we the knives cut away any weeds that are close, and then the fingers come back and they get in between, uh, in between the row where the knives obviously can't get to. And that's been very helpful um, cutting down a lot of the crops that we don't have time to hoe by hand. This gets a lot of the weeds and the, the field is a lot cleaner at the end of the growing cycle than we've been accustomed to. So this is, this is working out uh, really well this year. Um, then we have this machine. This is sort of a hybrid again. It's a mix of the first implement. It's a, it's a sweeps, but it also has the fingers. So after the guys thin out the lettuce and we side, we side dress, we come back. This will clean up the middles. It'll clean up the in between the rows. It makes the furrows again. So this is pretty much the last uh, implement that some of the crops see. It, and it's just a one final pass through to uh, clean everything up before everything gets too big. And then over here I have my, uh, my finger weeders. I have the bigger fingers on to uh, get some, sometimes long duration crops, the weeds will come back again. And, uh, but they're, they're really big. So this is set up to kind of get underneath and still clean up you know, the row, in between the row, next to the row. And then I have the, the sweeps in the back to hill, hill it up again. So this has been really helpful with um, crops that take a little bit longer. I have more opportunities to go in and knock the small weeds away. And then you could tell the A-B test you know, much cleaner versus, you know, where it would be a field of weeds. Um, so this one's also a, uh, a, a system that we haven't had on the farm before, and it's working out real well. So, and that's it. That's the, the six implements I've, I have currently. I'm currently brainstorming a, uh, a hilling machine for my leeks, so maybe next year we'll have one of those. And, you know, the sky's the limit. You think it, you can build it, so the the wide uh, array of different things that they offer, you could build anything you want, really. Just, just come up with it and you're good to go, so thank you.